What's up guys, we're back here, and we are going back into some Lay the Spire Downfall. Last time we played a little bit of Automaton, and we had a interesting uh, run. I don't even know how to describe it as much so. It was just interesting. Um, doubling up effects. It was just it was just kind of like a good stuff run. This time we're going to go back into Sneko. It's level 3 here. Alright, what to do, what to do. Hmm, I always don't know what the best ones to take are. Tabaton has good cards for curses, but overall, unless we get a lot of them, it's hard to make a deck with them. I think Defect is better still. Silent Guardian. I'm always leaning towards the Silent um, for these, just because the Silent's good. It has just generically good cards. The Silent Defect. Uh, I'll try Guardian. I don't think I've ever done it. And then we'll do Ironclad just to round it out. Um, I think it's a little bit more consistent than the camp there. Okay, random rare card to obtain. Lose all our souls. Move a card for consistency. The end terror. Um, we are essential level three, so elites spawn more often. Normal enemies and elites are now more deadly. Map two. Map. So two max. A rest situation. I think we can get three rest maximum. Okay. So, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, no, it is two. This is like the best path here. Honestly, getting extra rest kind of seems nicer. Um, I feel like it's definitely down the center that we're going. Well. Left side's got two rest. I can go ahead and knock out the Emerald Elite. Not the worst path. Let's go ahead and try to do that. It's later in the floor too, so we can go ahead and get some cards, like upgraded, get them uh, prepared. Uh, so that being said, I don't even have a shop. We have a late shop. So let's go ahead and get, choose a rare card. Unknown three cost, eh, restock. And draw five cards. Exhaust. Exhaust zero. Deck proof. Whenever you play an off class card, draw a card. I kind of like exotic form. It's a good just draw engine, but it's so expensive for just one more draw. Uh, restock's just super powerful. Let's you, like, you know, fix a bad hand. And three cost cards are good, but, like, what's the pool? Let's see. Thunder, Echo Form, Hyper Beam, Demon Form, Fierce Bash, Bludgeoning. There's some of these that would just not be good. Huh. And upgraded just makes an upgraded three cost card. Hmm. Really? I don't really know. I don't think I've really used Exotic Form, so let's try it. It's not powerful currently, but I think we can uh, make it pretty powerful. Let me remember what this next deck is. Honestly, upgrading Tail Whip sounds really good. Recalling the key would be fine, but we can't crack it yet. And they don't have a multi-attack in their arsenal to start with, so I think it's better to Smith to get the guaranteed weakness and vulnerability off Tail Whip. Always good. Since it's random, it's hard to like play it, and then if you get zero, you kind of kind of whip there. And model the highest cost card. Um. I even kill one six plus so be fight you'll be to eleven, so I can't I can kill one of them. Muddle the highest. Let's go ahead and play these off. Then we'll muddle. Take it to zero. So we'll take one here. That's not too bad. And then oh in <laughs> demon form. Nice to meet you. Alright, tell whip there. Go. Um, okay. So we want off-class cards. So any of the question mark ones are good. Just call our off-class. Draw that many plus ones. Rotation's also good for that. And it's an uncommon. Exhaust a card in your hand. Replace it with a random card of the same type that costs less. I think I'll go rotation to start with. Just because it's more uncommon. Oh, consume is gross. Gain two focus. Um, let's go ahead and rotation here. Roll two cards. Spot weakness is good, just not yet. 
the snake fight here. Oh, yeah, it's probably just got more expensive. Um, tail whip here for weakness. One defend. There we go. Okay, seven. Can't kill you, so we will. Rotation does nothing here. I also thought it exhausted. So that's good to know. Alright. Then, now what's the kill? Okay. Like Iron Fang. But we still we need to start getting some unknown cards, or our exotic form is going to do nothing. So, let's go ahead and start doing that. Transform three cards. I like that. I have a shop here. I don't know if I have enough money to remove it. How many question marks do we got? We have one. One curse isn't the worst. Let's transform three. I like the idea of that. One. What do we get? I, I want to kind of keep track. Dice boulder. Okay. So that's an attack. So we'll do another attack. Got iron fang. Very good. And then we'll do one defend. Danger noodle. A nine damage. Repeat this for each off class card in your hand. Then exhaust. Those cards. Oh, okay. Interesting. But it, it, it plays into what we were thinking, so I'm kind of okay with it. I like Dice Boulder. Okay, auto shield. Uh, 12, 12, 12. Yeah. I like Dice Boulder here. 17. Not bad. I'm okay with taking one. Um. Then I think we go. Iron Thing? Well, that's the high roll here. Um. Rotation doesn't do anything. Don't have any off class cards. Iron Thing. Got six. Not too bad, though. Named Neck by Danger Noodle became three, which is not as good. We will. Another demon form. It's really, really wanted. High, high play? Yep. I like that folder a lot. Oh, here we go. Um. I think you go X cost because it can never really let you down as much. And there's a good set of cards Whirlwind, Tempest, uh, Reinforced Body, Multi Beam. Those are all pretty good. The only one that's kind of a whiff is the, um, the Multicast. I think it's the, the one that's the most a whiff. Okay. Hello. Can't play Force Field. Uh, I mean, let's go with Rotation to start with. Uh, okay. Iron Fang here. Six blocks. And. Still haven't played Exotic Form. It's a little too cumbersome right now. I don't think we have. We're still setting up for it, I think. Oh. Yeah, whip. Ooh, weakness and vulnerability. We hit them both. Win eight. I mean, I think you go Snake Bite, hoping no, that it goes to zero. Rupture's good, but I don't think we need it this time. Let's go Rotation. Nice. Um, three. I think this does it, right? It doesn't do it. Unfortunate. Okay, no. Oh, he was blocking anyway. Didn't matter. Body, not body slam. Oh, he's dead anyway. Almost body slam for nothing, but didn't matter. And then he's playing at the start of each turn. Add a random off-class card to your hand in the middle. Yeah, there you go. That works really well. Um, the courier. I like the courier. This is this early. All prices reduced by 20% and they restock. So, we'll take that. Good relic right there. Um, I mean, playing exotic form's good. I don't think it's quite necessary yet. Go up and then go ahead and do the four with. Okay, unending supply here is pretty nice. Then I guess bash for vulnerability. Start for next turn. Snack bite, then bash could have been better if we would have got it off, but all compile error effects, that's terrible. Um equilibrium's pretty good actually though. In your hand. Could I get something better though? Because I just want to break them at this point. I gotta get them down to 34. I need 12 damage. Nice bullet could do it, but it also could fail on it. Let's do rotation here. See what we got. Ooh, okay. I think Tail Whip, very good. He's interrupted. Overclock here. Iron Fang, no. Well, yeah, Iron Fang has much potential. Eh, none of these are that great. Iron Fang, and then we'll just clean code here. 
getting back to whirlwind would be really good. Roll attack. This would affect all enemies otherwise bracing. Not the best. Ooh, they are coming in strong. And we equilibrium here, retain the hand. Then let's muddle, maybe play exotic form. Nope. I think that could be ways to do it too, is just uh, keep um, playing cards until you muddle this into playability. Could be a way to do it. Equilibrium aids this, gross. Um, I mean, danger noodle here, I feel like. Good get the kill, right? And we exhaust a bunch of some good stuff and some just garbage. Sorry, I had to mute a second. This car alarm is going off. Which is always lovely. Um, yeah, I snack bite here. Enchanted sword did go down to zero. Increase the damage of this. All right, and then we hail here. Well, I, I really have to block though. Nice move. Hit the block. Well, but I can. Take no damage. Should have done it the other way. It's whirlwind. Alright, weakness potion's great. Unknown exhaust card. Improved guard. Add random off class skill to your hand and muddle it. Yep. And we're one. More off class. <laughs> um, start with two buffer. I mean, that saws our. Our take 11 damage right here. And gain strength if we can protect it. I think so. We'll do that to start with. Blocks us for 11. We don't really get anything else done, but we start getting strength now. Okay. Um, let's muddle. This came to two. Not enough. Random orb here. Frost. Okay, let's keep hitting them. So we got one strength out of that three cost card. Vision. You're doing 10 now. Let's improve guard. Entrench. Double R blocked 10. That blocks what we need. But I think we could do better with doing like. Vision. Here. Oh, we got the age. That's gross. Uh, rotation gets rid of it though. Rotation. I don't have to deal with it. Oh, okay. Whirlwind here is kind of nice. I think I'd rather. Tail Whip and then Iron Fang. That gets us to a new block. Oh, you're gonna die, Chelp. I think I'm good. Um, another Improved Guard. Well, let's strike him first. And then Improved Guard. Ignore Pain. Your HP cannot be reduced until the end of your next turn. I mean, that's good. I don't even know what class gives that. It has to be Ironclad, right? I don't even know. Another one. Um, our HP cannot be changed. So does that technically mean I can't take damage here? No. Huh. Like a weird buffer, in a way. Um, hmm. I mean, do you do Dice Bowler in hopes of killing them? Yes. 23. Came close. And the Fint here will take four more. The age finally got me. There's the Void. Eh. Danger Noodle should do it. Yep. Mm hmm. All these upgrade all off cost cards in your extent. No, I think I need more, more off class. We'll take that. The weird one. What would I upgrade? Part of me is like, I want to recall, but. You go zero. Nice. Exotic form being more playable. I think maybe Snack Bite to muddle two cards in to make that more playable. I like that. Might not be the right move, but I, I think it's the only way we're going to eventually get to play it. Ooh, double tap here. Next attack is played twice. Yeah. And double tap. That's pretty good. Plenty of vulnerability and weakness there. Yeah. Oh, actually. Hello. Pretty good. Use dice boulder. Only got five there. Ah. Editing supply might have been better, but the thorn there is really good. Okay. Uh, tempest. Really, what I'm going with? More block over the the next turn. I mean, more damage. Six additional damage every turn. 
that better than playing seven here? I think so. Oh. Anything else here good? Oh, got the eight to grow. So. But, yeah, we're not even going to have enough to remove it. Unless we kill him, which... Um, let me... Strike, he'll take five here. That's fine. Eh. Not that powerful yet, but... We'll get through. Um, we were mugged. I didn't even realize they ever said that. Quick moves, also good. Muddle, muddle two cards. Defensive. Do I really want an unknown one cost? Let's try quick move. Just to try to get out of exotic form since we're not struggling with it. Oh, cheap stocks. Good for... Unknown dexterity cards. Not also, also not too bad. Master strategy would have been good. Same with captain's wheel. But I think I'll take cheap stock. Oh, actually, no. We can actually remove the aged. That's much better. Cheap stock's good, but I think we can find it again later. Hello. Okay, this is nice. Let's go ahead and get out all of our nonsense then. It'll be a hard one. Oh, ancient construct. Kind of nice. Quick move here to get out, what, vent steam maybe? It's one of the highest though. Oh, we still can get out vent steam. Okay. Want to get in unending supply. Okay. And... I guess we go for the snake bite now. All right. And there we go. Uh, let's rotation just in case. No. Should go in to start with with Danger Noodle here. Our vent steam kind of wore off, which is fortunate here. Maybe use the block potion. A danger Noodle exhaust them. So we'd exhaust multi beam, which isn't great. Dagger's probably vent steam, keeping that would have been good, but. We need to get some damage on him anyway. Go ahead and pop the block potions so we can uh, keep there. And ending, ending supply is going to continuously give us off class cards. So I shouldn't be too worried about exhausting them. Yeah, let's do that. And then we'll Iron Fang here for five, which is a good amount. I will only take three. All right, Heavy Blade here. Eh. Well, block. Zero cost to fin, which is nice. I think we do go for the tail whip. At least get some vulnerability. And then, so we'll take five more. Wish the weakness lasts longer, but he isn't attacking this form. Echo form for zero. Very good. Okay, Um, I guess double tail whip. Because I don't think we can, no, we can't kill him. So, unless we did double dice boulder and got ridiculous. Almost perfect. I think double tail whip here. Oh wait, we're not even doubling yet. Model the highest cost. Uh, did not get low enough, but where's the shot? Good artifacting there. Rapid strike. I was told to take this one last time. I think the reason I didn't take it was because I didn't have a lot of techniques when I played two days ago for the um, for the champ build. So I'll keep that in mind next time. I think it was a little later than what I wanted. I could do double danger needle, but that doesn't do anything. Honestly, double reinforced body might be the play. Just so I don't take any damage. Because all this is kind of kind of not too great. So, I'll do that. So, plenty of defense. Don't take no damage. Alright, 20. So, um, da dum dum. I mean, double. Double snack bites. 20 here. Get some muddles. Flame barrier. That's great. I mean, I could go in zero defend. Danger Noodle would hit well lane plans, which it's fine. I could just play. No, I think just yeah, well laid plans and reinforced body. Keep Danger Noodle for next turn. Yeah. So that should be good. Keep this. Kind of like that. Ooh, Darkling Trio. That's a weird one. But I think just double. Actually, Tail Whip's better than Heavy Blade right now. There we go. Didn't end up mattering, but a good, good roll of thinking. Unknown draw card. Like that. Common attacks. Ooh, Iron Wave, Claw. Got some good stuff in there, though. I'll try and scam overclock. I think we're okay on draw. I think I'd rather have some more attacks for the deck. Hmm, yeah. Let's 
well for each. I think getting exotic form playable a little better. Just a wee bit. Hello, Slava. Tide's pretty good. Guard's pretty good. Limit break. Interesting. Um, snack bite? Zero? Nope. The opposite. Ball, lightning, tail whip. Uh, let's tail whip. Weakness, and then. Need more energy, but. If we can get there or not. Great of AI is pretty good, but. Quick move here. Makes that one. Let's Iron Fang first, so we get 14. We're plenty, so we'll do Creative AI. We might already had it, but. Ooh, Otter Shield first. Piercing High. Dice Boulder. There we go. Creative AI with Sneko, I think, is really fun because you just get, like, so much randomness. And just pulling from a bunch of different ones. Right, Rest restock here. When the uncommon attack though, thunder, whirlwind, restock. It really like fixes some problems with hands. What do you hands? Not cost three. Soul cleanse is also very good. Not exhaust. Discard your hand. Draw five, five to ten cards. Exhaust. Let's do soul cleanse because it doesn't exhaust. That way we can try to play stuff. We already got a little bit of draw in the exotic form. Let's quick move first. Got fusion down, channel the plasma, and then we will exotic form here. Alright. Um, um, do turbo here. Random off cost. Let's do this. Power from beyond, so. Let's rotation those two out. Draw some cards. Soul cleanse does not really help us here, unfortunately. Seven, they're doing 16, so I mean, this and the fine. Could have soul cleansed for the hope to reduce the cost by one, but I think get a reason to. Uh, seeing red's fine. Honestly, danger noodle here. I don't know, there's only one card here. I tail whip, it's pretty good. Dice boulder, hopefully. Four, unfortunately. Still get the kill here. Extra guard, pretty good. Draw two power from beyond. So that sets up for next turn. Oh, there's Dev's tools. Does not help us here. Um, we'll, we'll see what we can get out of it. Yeah, secrets compile. No. Just play it to draw a card, I guess. 15. We're doing good. 15 right there, so we got them. Oh. Not bad. The plasma, honestly, was very good. I know, compound. Uh, I think I'd rather have the vulnerability. Stuff like shockwaves, very good. Alright, eight coming in to start with. Alright, um, quick move first. Static form down to one, I like it. And the enemy is vulnerable, which they're not, so we'll just iron break it. A little bit more block. See if we can get the perfected, we're at 60, so we need to keep that in mind. Oh, there's some damage coming in. You only have five block, so... Rotation first. Hologram. Oakland could be good here. Um, I don't know if that's better or worse. I think we tail whip. Vulnerability. I need a block. A weakness. 20. I don't think I can get to that. Even with these cards. Or pile into your hand. What would I put into here? Quick move, maybe? Be good. I think we snake bite. Hope to... I mean, we did flip it. Quick move for one. Got the improved guard. Quick move up to 11. 16. All we could get to. We tried. Still just one of those things. All right. Um, I mean, underneath supply here. <laughs> the darkness. Weird. Uh, I think I'd rather have camping stuff. Just six additional damage every turn. Darkness could have been a weird finisher since we have Tempest in the deck, but. I don't really want the fight to go that long if we don't have to. A Tail Whip for free, the drop kick gives us more energy back. Um, they're doing 15 here. I can get five block. Good shit, man. Yeah, five. Let's go ahead just with the bash. Keep the vulnerability going. Rotation here, anything good? Huh. Get a little bit of defense. Not bad. And this is Witch Ironclad. 
generates statuses. So this one duplicates statuses into our deck. Not that great. Um, I mean, I kind of just like... Quick move here. Oh, that was the worst. I wanted to play that. I guess I will play the darkness. Might as well. Because now I'm thinking about it, that I do have Tempest. A bit slow, but... Yeah. Immediately contradict myself. Oh, Streamline and a Dynamic Glow. Glow, Streamline. The draw is just... Alright, still taking a little bit of damage here. Alright, um... Tail Whip, Deadly Poison, which is odd. I didn't remember getting that. Um, should I channel a second Darkness? Okay. Most of just continue to draw more cards. And if we can get Tempest, I think we got this. Not get Tempest. Is he still vulnerable? He is not vulnerable. Um, he is doing a lot of damage this one. Rotation out of this. So we can draw. Upgrading that would be very good. Uh, if I guard here. Cloak and Dagger. Six block. Damage. No, I think I want to... Ooh, zero here. I don't think that's enough, though. And we're not dead, but... Oh, he, that does kill him. The poison ended up mattering, and the darkness ended up dead. Fine. Uh, let's drop the artifact for the duplication. I've got to remember to play him, but... Full rolls. Muddle your hand. Limited rolls. Add a soul roll. Zero and exhaust. Innate. I mean, I like that. I don't think I need a second exotic form. Restock's also very good, but I think I like that better. Two less cards to choose from. Add a rim. At the start of your turn, or bigger hands. Oh, no, no, this the change timely. I'm thinking of a different, I'm thinking of a slimy hat. Add a study the spire card to your hand. I feel like we need more energy. But oh, we're about to start muddling every hand. Let's take the, the zero cost study the spire cards. I don't think I've taken um, tiny bowler hat, so I'm kind of curious how that'll end up working out for us. Two elites are the max. Rest. Do three rest, but I think I'd rather go for the two elites this time. Has to the path. Eh, it's fine, there's a couple question marks. No shops. The right path looks a little better. But still not that great. I think I'll go for the two elites. That. Um, break the emerald. Recall the... Let's break that for the decks. Go ahead and get this one. Alright. Getting the innate on that... Um, roll will be good. Study the spire. Random boss card every turn. That's pretty good. Aggregate for every four cards in your draw pile. Six energy here. Temporal shield. I mean, there's no reason to soul clint here. Exotic form. Danger needle. Technically, I guess playing exotic form first would make more sense. Because then I could have drew some more cards. Yeah. Prayer crush. Very good. Team cell. Go for the eyes. Okay. Um, neck bike? Really, though. I mean, I could get some stuff for free, but... Unending supply. Neck bite. That was not what I wanted. Take two here. Alright. I mean, we could slime crush one out of existence. You are mine. Good. Yes, and vulnerability. Uh, I mean, slime crush is fine. I can blow one of them out of the map. 52. Yeah. And then we go... Iron Fang. He's within 8. That was mine. I didn't think that was the right move, but working out very good. Uh, zero cost cards. Sure. I like them. Yeah, Study the Spire was definitely the right move there. Like, to grab. Am I exotic forming or am I just going to Tempest for a million? Exotic form is just too good not to do. Now that we can, like, go through it. The only, like, advantage would be maybe trying to get it cheaper. File package. Here we got Orb Walker. 
So strength base, accelerate, and ore block. I think it's a little too slow for this. The sentry ones are pretty good, the weakness. Hmm. <laughs> I kinda like the recursion of this sentry package. Sentry wave, sentry wave, sentry blast. Um, last stand's our boss card. I mean, is Danger Needle just a million damage here? Is this even kill? I mean, we should do the math. We need it to be 70, so... 1, 2, 3, 4, it's not. But I think it's still good. That was good. Alright, and then next bite for 12. But we only have one more. Block instead. Hmm, two highest cards, so I could hit any of these three. And greedy? No, let's do a pro. Yeah, that was the better one. Finish off there. Okay. Kill it. And we last stand. And then we bite them. Not too bad. I'm, I'm liking where this is going. Well, they're plus one. No. It's just more off class cards. Oh, snake plant. Snake plant sucks. I really dislike snake plant. Boot synchro tier is very good. Yes, I am playing that exotic form. I, I wasn't actually planning to play it. I was trying to think how I could get out of playing it, but there was no way. We're taking a lot of damage here. Okay, invincible, fine. Um, are they, they're not vulnerable. I think piercing hide here is very good. I want to make them vulnerable and weak. I technically there should have been a. I should have been playing drop kick first and then played it. A little out of order there, but it's fine. Ow. Okay. Never mind. Dum 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 dum. That danger noodle is now free. There we go. Snack oil. Oil for a snack. Uh, another X cost card. Card. I mean, trash of treasures is really good, and you can make it not exhaust. That helps you like unbind your hand, in my opinion. I am going right. Correct. Yeah. Right here. Ritual dagger or cold switch potion. Voltage Potion helps a lot on the final fight. We're halfway. I don't think I take Ritual Dagger that often. Let's try it. We're just like a weird hodgepodge here. Alright, um, I think we do it, make sure I do this correctly. Exotic form, then study this fire. I get one additional draw. Improvise guard. Process of not bad. Planning. Six here. Not bad. Trust the treasure here could help. Uh, I mean, you are mine for the weakness. So the next three turns, very good. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Not a lot of block here. I can't kill him with danger noodles, so. I'm gonna roll. So let's go ahead and get that out. Trust the treasure. I can get what? Two energy at the most. And then I could vent steam to see if I can draw on something else. Go ahead and trash the treasure. Let's do the walker claw. And then we'll, we'll core surge. Got meteor strike. That's a weird one. I can't muddle the hand unless I get lucky. We'll try it. Uh, battle trance. That helps. Ritual dagger for the kill. Echo form will be gone. Uh, unless we muddle into something crazy. Echo form. <laughs> meteor strike here. Okay. Okay. I don't know what's happening. We'll rage. We're trying to like generate block. Um, I mean, I think it's quick move now. Bottle something. Die folder. There we go. Iron thing. More block. And we got the 21. <laughs> With two plasma. That's the fun thing about the Sneko. Is you can just randomly get into weird stuff like this. I did not mean to do that twice. I forgot we played Echo Form for free. Underneath supply is good. Oh, I'm glad it doesn't count it, though. That's kind of nice of them. That since it can't play it twice, it only plays it once. It's a good little synergy right there. Um, Soul Royal is not that great. Um, I mean... 
One, two, so we'll draw three. This is just draw three, so we'll go with that. Um, soul roll's not that great here. Everything's pretty low cost. Corrosive. Improvised guard. Two here. So 15. Now I guess I... Vent steam. Oh, I can't draw no more cards. So we'll just roll here for free stuff. Or stuff to get less. A we'll soul cleanse. Not get any less. I got more. Okay. Ooh, evil within. We used this last time to very good success. Uh, I don't really want Hexaburn as much, so that's why get two of them. Oh, and they're exactly the same. Doesn't matter that I have five HP. I wasn't paying attention to that. Unknown egg. Card rewards are now upgraded. Very good. Colorless. Skill. Let's do colorless. Pretty good. Eternal feather healing. Yeah, let's definitely agree with that. I'm gonna make this a chonky deck probably, so. Study the Spire. Tail Whip. Um, I don't really. Rotation here. Ooh, let's go ahead and do unlimited rolls. Making that a Nate also gonna be good. Alright, feed. Last, last stand first. Um, I guess I trash the treasure. On the Tempest, I'd get a bunch, right? Do I get three out of this? I don't remember. I do. Then I go for the Bash here. Oh, I don't have the... The Huzuma weapon. I can't actually um, take advantage of the draw. The off-class stuff. Ah, uh, Invincible again. I, yeah, I kind of just want to... Nature Needle here. And we'll Iron Claw. I shouldn't take any damage to Open. A roll. Look for a failure. Okay. Crip. Hexaburn. Uh, stack, I, I suppose. 15 damage going in. Soul roll. Terrible. Take one. Okay. Uh, meteor strikes here. Quick move. Meteor strike. Yeah. I'm liking the fact that we're getting a lot of them. Um, improvised guard. I'm liking them. Honestly, I'm not really using my potions like I should be. I'll skip it. So I should use... Let's go ahead and use the region here. Okay. That... End ending supply is pretty good. Trace a card from your discard into stasis. I have nothing in there. But doing... I do both. I guess Iron Fang and then Recover. Put Iron Fang up in there. I do want this fight to go four turns, probably. Hexaburn, okay. Am I going to be playing exotic form here? If I do, I'm saying I'm not blocking pretty much. Exotic form, discover. Restock here? Yeah, maybe, let's do that. Okay, that's very good. Um, all cleanse first. Yep. I think the two free improvised guards is very nice. I'm going to trash the treasure the overclock here, which is very nice. Um, I don't really want the expunger. Uh, dum, dum, dum. I think I'll go ahead and re rotation now. Okay. Snack bite here. I've not got a lot done. As much as I would like, honestly. Full move. Okay. Then still not that great. But we got 25 blocks, so. It worked out, but I did not get a lot of damage on board. So that's probably a better way, much better way to play that, but I'm okay with it. Um, Iron Fang here for free. Go ahead and invincible here to draw another card. Improvised guard. Uh, that's not that great. Um, Snack Bite. Ancient powers, good, right? Add a random power to your hand. I get all cards. Oh. Let's go ahead and do this. Muddle shield and ritual dagger. Go ahead and get the ritual dagger kill. Good. Only got 13 block. Let's go ahead and exhaust the expunger. Fine. As long as we 
gain energy off of this. I'm okay with it. Fair crush. Very good. I mean, danger noodle. Pretty good, but I mean. Yeah, let's go ahead and danger noodle one of these two. Exhaust most of the hand. Quick move. For 10, we are taking a tiny bit. Bit steam here. Auto shield. And not play Dracula trade. All right, we're 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 starting to to uh to flop here. That now they're getting stronger than I want them to. Knock him out. Wish I had some AOE here. Don't. Mm hmm hmm hmm. I can't block past this pretty much. And I have no reroll. Potential here. Gain 13. Yeah, I could just gain 32 block. Which is the boring way to do it. But... Unlimited rolls up there, I guess. Okay. Didn't take any damage here. Kill this one now. Hopefully. Yep, overheat for zero. Auto shield, pretty good. Muddle shield would be good too. Uh, we're not muddling that much. Um, quick move. Muddle shield, I, for no reason. Oh, the hex, the hex should be doing the thing this time. The raw danger noodle. I actually don't really have a lot to, no to noodle here. I think just go tail whip, rotation, draw some different stuff. Neck bite, iron fang. Oh, they are three away. I should have duplicated it. I think hex burn will kill them. It does. That one was did not go the way I wanted it to. Sheet. I mean, maximum possible effect. Random number. See, I I don't think that'll work very well. I'd rather have the dexterity card. Lose 50 souls, gain 33 HP. I mean. 23. Where's our breast at? Yeah, at least one more fight here. I'll give the souls to the HP. So that way I can upgrade a card. I'm glad I did. Stack plant. Merge me. Internally. Uh, shockwave here. Group guard. Go ahead. Adrenaline for three. Not quite. Okay. Ooh. This is a weird one. Um, exotic form, both limbs. Uh, that was worse. Crash to treasure on, honestly, the Chrono Boost, right? No. Let's go on the Snake Bite. I think I'd rather play Mayhem. Quick move here. Okay. That's not the best, not the worst. Ooh, Mayhem. Very good. Um, Blizzard's terrible. Unending supplies. Unlimited rolls. I need to get these out sooner than I am, really. Yeah. Ouch. All right, Invincible. Beam Cell. Charge up, I suppose. I really like this hand. Of all cards into the draw pile. Draw four. Yeah, it's 30 HP or less to kill them. I can't do that. Danger Noodle would be pretty punishing. And then what? I can still guard, so let's do that. And that still kills them. I, I, I don't ever respect the Noodle. And sometimes it just does it. More upgrade skills. Okay, Gremlin. Intimidate steals six cards. 12 cards, match them, and keep, keep them 5 tries. I've not stole. I mean, let's fight and gain 6 cards. Oh, so it's Gremlin Knob. Interesting. I think we're fine with that, though. Orb support here. Should beam cells first, but it's fine. Get plenty of damage on him. 52. I do want to try to blow him up as fast as possible. 
Ten more block. Can I get ten more block? Um, yeah. No. I can't. Um, well... Fascinating. Very weekend though, so the not play Guardian World. Okay. Take a little bit, it's fine. Ritual dagger, I mean I can just kill this man. Um I... Guardian World's really, really trying. Hey bike. Oh, zero cost bash here is pretty good. Try in rotation. Danger Noodle here? Eh. I don't think it'll do 29. Um, hum hum hum. 30 damage is a lot. So it's 10 per, I have one. If I weaken you, let's duplicate the block card. I mean, if Recycle was less, I could continue to do random things, but I think we'll have to take it. Oh, getting feed out here would be very nice. Go new blast, and then feed. Okay, I mean, that was something. Gremlin side, palm pick up. Add the following cards to your deck. Fight shift, dice crash, question mark, turn gambit, finesse, normality. Interesting, 100 souls, liquid memories. We add an ironclad card. And we'll add all these cards, might as well. All right, break the ruby here. Got some more healing, nice. Uh, unlimited rolls. Let's go ahead and get that in our opening hand. Add some color consistency. We hard fight here, but I think we can do it. Ooh. No. <laughs> City Spire. Uh, that, I mean. That kind of thinks. Let's do this and try to get a bunch of fo some more strength and decks. This is going to hurt. Does it kill us? But it's 20, 34 damage on the first turn. And 24 here is not enough to kill them, though. Which is unfortunate. I guess I'll do that. And then we continue zero. Down to 12. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thunderclap is all enemies. So I think I Thunderclap first. Get the vulnerability across. Chrono boost here. Tail whips 16. That to you. Soul roll. I think we're just dead. Right. Get eight there. Yep. This was not not our, our snack time. I the deck just never like was just too mismatched. Like, the exotic form was great. When it worked out, it worked out really well. But, there was just too much randomness. Normality would have sucked if we drew up to it. Ice shift was terrible. Yeah, we just, it just wasn't working. But we got the unlocks, so that's good. Upon pickup, obtain a, upon pickup, obtain an unknown rare card of each card type. That's kind of cool. Sleeved ace. Uh, to start, you just kind of add a cheat into your hand with retain. That's pretty good, too. Take Charmer, muddle cards cannot cost three. Also, very good. But that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.